As with any tool you use to get a job done, the more you understand how to use it, the more proficient you are at using it to get the job done. For a software application, a key part in using the tool is being able to proficiently navigate the user interface. In this demonstration, you will see different aspects of AutoCAD for the Max user interface. You will explore and adjust what user interface elements display and use commands to change the display of the drawing geometry. Access to many tools and commands used to create and modify geometry are found in the menus, tool sets, palettes, status bar, and the command line. We begin our demonstration by using the layers palette to change the display of geometry in the canvas. Most of the commands used to create and edit geometry can be conveniently found on the tool sets. Each tool set is loaded with the commands needed to complete the required tasks. Within each tool set, commands are arranged in logical groups, enabling you to quickly find the tools you need. The Properties Inspector palette enables you to edit the characteristics of geometry and other objects already placed on the canvas. The available options displayed are determined by the objects selected. In our example, we are moving the revision cloud and text just created to the dimension layer. AutoCAD incorporates layouts to enable you to always create your geometry at full scale. You view and access the available layouts from the status bar. You can view the list, or you can visually select a layout by clicking the Show Drawings and Layouts button. The status bar also contains the standard viewing and panning controls that enable you to control the display of the canvas. AutoCAD often uses the command line to communicate with you. As we list the title block, we can look at the command line and see that this is an AutoCAD block titled XTitle and that it is on the Elevation M layout. In addition, we review many other properties of the title block. For those who enter the 3D world, AutoCAD is fully equipped to handle your designs. The modeling tool set is dedicated to the creation and editing of 3D solids, meshes, and surfaces. It also includes many of the 2D commands needed for the creation of 3D geometry. In addition, you can use the View Cube to view your model from all angles. You can use the Viewport Label menu to alter the display characteristics of your model. By selecting any of the available visual styles, you change the display of your model. As you can see, AutoCAD is equipped with many tools that enable you to create and edit drawings. Proficiency in accessing the commands needed to complete your designs is the foundation for efficient use of the software.